بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد The Prophet عليه الصلاه والسلام said فانما هلك من كان قبلكم بكثره سؤالهم واختلافهم على انبيائهم في ذا نهيتكم عن شيء فاجتنبوا وإذا أمرتكم بأمر فأتوا منه ما استطعتم The Prophet عليه الصلاة والسلام said Verily what destroyed those people who came before you was their excessive questioning so they questioned their prophets they questioned the text They, call, they tried to call the Prophet وسلم, or the NBA وسلم, uh, to account when they were the ones who were going to be held accountable before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to follow their message and the messengers So what destroyed those who came before you is their excessive questioning and they're differing with their prophets. So if I have prohibited you from something, then avoid it. And if I have commanded you with something, then do it as much as you can. Alayhi salatu wasalam. This is what the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam said. That we should do as much as we can of following his sunnah. Strive our best. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us of our many shortcomings. And our many sins. And we should avoid his prohibitions. The things that the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam prohibited us from. Because those are the commands of Allah. And as we mentioned countless times, that's from taqwa. Taqwa Allah That taqwa is comprised of the, what Allah commands and what he tells you to avoid. By doing, you're exercising taqwa, God-fearfulness, by doing the commands of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and avoiding his prohibitions. And likewise, by following the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and avoiding those things he, he prohibited us from, you're exercising that taqwa. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us with taqwa Allah azza wa jal and forgive us of our many sins. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad.